stuff that's going on in the news bothers me, yes, because I'm a human being and I don't like to see anyone come to harm or be living in a situation that's less than they could be, considering we have so much abundance in the world and so many resources and only a certain people have access to them. That stuff bothers me um, when it doesn't have to be that way. But at the same time, with all of that going on, there's so much beauty in the world as well. There's so much good things going on in the world. There's so much things to be happy about in the world. It's just not being documented on the news. We're seeing mostly the, the negative things that are happening in the news. So if you're consuming only that, or you're consuming the news as just your, like your, you know, your window to the world and what human beings are doing and living like, then you're gonna find yourself uh, looking down on life. Do you know what I mean? Like, uh, you know, looking down on the behavior of humankind when only a portion of it is being documented on the news. That annoys me that only some of it is being shown and, and, and there's, there's a group of people are showing what they decide to cover when it could be balanced out, you know, and the world might seem like a nicer place and people may be able to make more informed choices about the way they live and the way they see the world and the way they view the world and the, the way they feel when they go out of their houses or even if they feel like going out of their house because if you watch the news every day, you wouldn't want to leave your house. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you're living in fear, yeah, exactly. That's the part of it, you know, that affects me, that I don't like. The fact that I, I wish I could give, you know, more people that outlook, that it, it, it's not all bad. Like, if you watch the news every day, you're not gonna, you're not gonna feel good in yourself. You're gonna think, wow, what am I living in, you know? You're not gonna feel there's any hope for mankind. It's just getting worse and worse and worse and worse. When that's only one portion that's being documented of how we live or how we exist. It's not gonna sell papers to say, oh, you know, this person done this amazing, great thing for another human being today, <laughs> you know? Well, to a degree, but no, 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 it's more so when someone kills somebody, you know, you're gonna hear about that first, you know? You know what I mean? Like, I'm just giving you like positive and negatives. Like, you're gonna always get, you know, oh, it's really bad weather today. It's gonna be terrible weather. There's a storm coming. Not this really amazing weather in this other place. Like, wow, we haven't had weather like this, you know? Uh, it, it, it's, the ratio of it is, is so like negative and positive, it's so negative all the way, like and only a fraction of positive. Yeah, we're just pumped. The minute you put that box on, you're just like pumped full of it. Like you, once your eyes are looking at it and your ears are open, you're just like pumped full of that information. And if it's only, like you said, what did you say, 5% positive? Is that what you said? Yes, so that's 95% negative information you're receiving, like you're, you're open to, so your outlook, what's it going to be? It's going to be 95% negative when you step out your door every day. So what kind of world does that create? What kind of mindset, what kind of people are you in your workplace with? If everyone stepped out with that 95% negative outlook on their day and, and the people they're around and the people they have to interact with on the way to work, on the bus, on the train, and in the office, you know? It's interesting how, how that could change if more of that percentage was uh, positive. You know, I turn off my uh, my TV a lot and uh, don't put it on for, for that reason. I want to kind of be more in control of, of the information I absorb. Because if I watch the news every day, my outlook on life is going to be like completely different to what it is now, which is so far the other way, so far 95% positive and 5% negative. It's like taking the bad of one thing and just pick, like, I don't know what percentage of it you'll say is bad, but it's like taking focus on that particular area, you know, like not focus on the other areas, just that area that's bad. Like an apple, you just focus the camera on the, the rotten bit <laughs> and not the rest of it that's okay to eat. You know, that's what the news is to me. Like they've just, it's one big apple, the world, and parts of it are rotten and they've just taken the camera and pointed it at the rotten bit. And no one, no one can see out what's behind the camera. They can only see the rotten, the rotten bit of the apple. They can't see the bit where it's, uh, it's good to eat. This is good to digest. This is still, there's still a lot of good here. 